For this video, we'll simplify the fraction 5 fortieths. And what we want to do here, we have 5 fortieths, we want to find another fraction that's the same as 5 fortieths. Its value is the same. We call it an equivalent fraction, but we've reduced it to lowest terms. To do that, we need to find a common multiple, the greatest common multiple, something that goes into 5 and 40. I know that 5 times 8 is 40, so maybe I'll just divide the numerator and the denominator by 5. Let's see how that works. 5 divided by 5, that's just 1. 40 divided by 5 is 8, because 8 times 5 is 40. And we've simplified the fraction 5 fortieths down to 1 eighth. We can't reduce this any further. These are what we call equivalent fractions. They have the same value. That's why we have the equal sign there. If you divided 5 by 40 and 1 by 8, you'd get the same number. It's just that we've reduced the fraction 5 over 40 down to 1 over 8. This is Dr. B. Thanks for watching.